So this is the first part of this trouser that already has the pocket attached as you can see just like this so this is the pocket even if i'm not yet done with um, the trouser but this is the pocket so i want to show you how i achieved this pocket using the second side of the trouser so now this here is this part of the trouser and as you can see i have already nudged this part here so on this same point here i'm going to measure eight inches from the top and i'm going to make the markings on this point now if you are not sure if you are getting confused on how to place it don't forget that this is how your pocket is going to be because this is going to be the inside so this point is going to be the one with this part of the shoulder so this is where you are going to make your own um, notion so we'll come back to this part of the to this pocket and then we measure eight inches down just like this so on this eight inch part i'm going to make the marking on the one inch part of it which is this i'm going to make this marking on this one inch then i'm going to mark it again on the eight inch point and then i'm going to cut in by half inch for the both sides now also don't forget as you can see that i've already closed the bottom of this pocket so i'm going to go on to run the sides and i'm going to stop at this point where i'm marked here so this here is what we have then i really don't need to do the same for this top now i'm going to bring it to this trouser part here and we are going to put it just like this and then run it so as you can see what i did put the flap the trouser part and the pocket sides don't forget to bend out the inside so you don't sew it by mistake and then we are going to sew it so as you can see we've attached it now we'll bring it to the back side just like this so you can see that our pocket is already taking shape, it's already forming. So this is what we have. So on this side here now, we are going to stitch it again, top stitching. So this is what we do. So guys this is the pocket then on this bottom side again i'm going to knot it a bit like one inch down and then hold this bottom part of the pocket together with this and leave this one out just so that when i'm also stitching the trouser i don't sew the pocket this is what I have. So you also just hold the top side in as well because you'll be sewing in the top side. As you can see, we have attached our second pocket to it and this is what we have. <laughs> 